Welcome everyone, it's time to kick off our leadership video of the month. Everyone has responsibilities they have to get done. For example, at my house, I'm responsible for keeping my room clean, feeding my cat, Mango, and cleaning the bathroom, even when it's kind of gross. When I'm in school, some of my responsibilities are coming to class on time, paying attention to my teacher and asking questions, and always doing my homework. Speaking of which. I also have a couple of responsibilities in my music classes. I have to make sure I attend my lessons regularly, always have my materials and instruments for class, and practice the assignments that my teachers give me. These are just a few different examples of some responsibilities you may have. They're not always fun to do, like cleaning the bathroom, but they're really important too. Imagine if you never cleaned your room, or you never did your homework, or you never practiced your instrument. What would happen? What might happen is we wouldn't get very far learning the things we need to know, or even be able to find our stuff in our messy, messy room. Being responsible affects all of the people around us. Imagine if your brother that you shared a room with had really stinky socks, and instead of putting them in the laundry, he just put them on the floor. That would stink, pun intended. What if you had dirty dishes and no one did any dishes for a whole month, and then there was a plate of moldy food on your kitchen counter that would also stink? What if you didn't take a bath or a shower for a full week, then you would stink. Not that you would ever stink, I know that you're very clean. Okay. <laughs> Wouldn't we all be more comfortable and get along better if we took care of our responsibilities? It might be hard at first, but once you make it a habit, you won't even think twice about it. This week, make sure you talk to your teachers about how you can practice being more responsible at home, at school, and in your music lessons. See you next month.